We understand that the mind that exists between the physical and spiritual world. We have grown up surrounded by the spirits of our relatives. So many have left early in our lives, dying from the disease of alcoholism. As children, we had to rely on our parents' stories to keep their memories and their teachings within our hearts. We wonder as we grow how our lives would be different if they could have walked with us and talked with us beyond our dreams. When I was just a little girl, my great uncle, Paul Joe Graves, the man that I was named for, would cross that thin line of death to play with me. He died before I was born from alcoholism. We wondered how our lives would have been if only they were still here. Would our family ties be stronger? Would there be less hurt and pain? What would our lives be like if this poison had never come our way? The casualties of alcoholism are as great as any war. Centuries has passed. Millions have been lost to this. And we have all grown up with the deep wounds of loss and grief. The youth of our nation live with a special understanding of the thin line that separates us from so many of our loved ones. Our sobriety keeps us strong, keeps the memory of our loved ones with us, and helps us to live long so we can be there to support the children and help to win the war against alcoholism.